हेलो एवरी वन आई एम रोहित एंड वेलकम टू माई यूट्यूब चैनल ए आई एरा सो गाइज इन दिस टू डेज पर्टिकुलर वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस विथ यू अ वेरियस मेथड्स ऑफ प्रिंट फॉर्मेटिंग विथ स्ट्रिंग सो विदाउट डूइंग एनी डिले लेट जम्प इन टू अ जुपिडो नोटबुक सो गाइज हियर आई मीन माई जुपिडो नोटबुक सो देर आर बेसिकली टू मेथड्स ऑफ प्रिंट फॉर्मेटिंग विथ स्ट्रिंग फर्स्ट इज अ डॉट फॉर्मेट मेथड एंड अनादर इज एफ स्ट्रिंग लिटर सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस वॉट इज a dot format method so here i can highlighted this this is a basically a pattern to use a dot format method we have to first write a string and the object that we have to format in place of that object we have to place a curly braces and after dot formatting in circular braces we have to mention that object so i can create a one print statement over here by using a print formatting method such as print that quotation mark define the object or the letter that i am written over here is the string so after that i just place a curly braces over here curly braces and after that i just write dot format and in circular braces i just write please comma subscribe comma AI era and we know that to execute this particular cell i have to press and shift enter in my jupyter notebook so guys you can see over here it will give me result that is please subscribe ai era so there is one more thing about the print formatting statement that is we can get a more flexibility here about a formatting string with using an indexing method such that i can just write a print and here i can index here i can mention my index in between my curly braces such as in python the indexing start from 0 then 1 then 2 and here i can write my object that is i can copy paste over here because I can kept my object same as above, so I can just copy paste it, and to execute this particular cell, I can press and shift. So you can see over here, it will give me same output as above. So you can change the index position, such as put an one over here, and write zero over here, and to execute this particular cell, we have to press and shift. So. as you see over here by changing only indexing method without doing any change in object you can change your output such as subscribe first of all it is please subscribe ai era and i can change my indexing position and it will shows me a uh, subscribe please ai era and the next method is to float formatting basically the pattern of float formatting is as follow first of all i can convert this cell is a markdown then the pattern goes like that in curly braces we have to mention our code after that we have to mention our value then width of white space after that precision Sorry for my typing error. And after that, I have to write a F lift. So this is my a pattern. Basically, I am use in upcoming code to work with float formatting or get more used to to get a float formatting. I just create a variable called result, and I can save my result such as hundred divided by one seventy seven. and i can press and shift enter to execute this cell and to get 
value of that result i can press and shift enter so you can see over here the value of result shows a 0.56 and a many digit after the decimal point but if i want a two or three digit after a decimal point then i can use here my float formatting method so i can use over here such as print the quotation mark then i can write the result was then i can follow this combination or this pattern over here such as curly braces then i have to mention my value the value is my r the result i can mention as a r and after that the white space or the width i can mention as a white space as a 1 after that i have to mention a precision means a precision defines as a number of digit after the decimal point so i can say i required a three digit after a decimal point and after that i just write a only f literal that is f and after that i just have to write a dot format and in close parenthesis r is equal to result and after writing this particular code i have to press and shift enter so you can see over here it gives me a very good result that shows the result was 0.565 so instead of getting a, a too much decimal point in your result you can use a float formatting method and convert it according to your requirement that is you want a particular digit two or three digit from a decimal point or a more digit such as if i enter a two over here and execute this particular cell it only shows me 0.56 so after that the last topic of today's video that is f string method f string method is one of the easiest method as compared to dot format method so therefore to get aware about the f string method first of all i have to create a variable called name and i can save name as a row that is my name in a name variable and i can execute this particular cell so row is get stored in a variable called name then i can use now f string method over here such as print uh, f literal after that in quotation marks we have to write hello my name is and in circular braces i have to write only name and it will show me hello my name is rohit so this is more simple as compared to the dot format method so according to your choice or according to your understanding you can use any one of them so uh, for getting more awareness or getting more intuition i just created one more example that is name is equal to rohit and my age is 25 and i can create another print statement says that print my f string format that is f literal and i can write in quotation mark hello guys my name is and i am h yes Old. after writing uh, this piece of code i have to press and shift enter so it will give me a very nice result it shows that hello guys my name is rohit and i am 25 years old so so guys this is enough for today's video this is all about uh, print formatting with string we are cover a uh, dot format method that is used for a string and to convert a float format after that we are take a close look of f string method that is format a string with f literal 
so this is all about today's video if you like this today's video please like it share with your friend and please subscribe my youtube channel that is ai era so guys thank you one and all